Hi guys, happy beautiful weekend. This is going to be a collective reading for all signs, okay? We're going to see what is going on, what is happening right now. I hope all is well with you guys, okay? What is up with my cards? Yes, I hope all is well with you guys, okay? Keep your guards up. Spirit guys, my God, the angel ascended masters, my God, angel Holy Spirit. What are the messages right now for everyone, Spirit? What is going on with everyone? What are the messages, Spirit, guys? My God, the angel or angel ancestors, ascended masters, my God, our angel Holy Spirit. What is going on right now for everyone, Spirit? For July the 14th, July the 15th, July the 16th, 2023. Collect a reading for all zodiac signs, spirit. What is going on right now for everyone? What should everyone know, hear, and see, spirit? What are the messages, spirit, guys, for everyone? What is everyone thinking and feeling, doing, up to, and going through, spirit? A collective reading for all zodiac signs. For July the 14th, July the 15th, July the 16th, 2023. Collective reading, spirit. What are the messages right now? Spirit, what is going on right now? What do we need to know, Spirit? What are the messages? Someone could be grieving over a loss of a loved one, a broken heart. Someone could be, like, crying, feeling regretful, hurtful. Like, someone could be missing someone. Could have been, like, a loved one that passed on, passed away, or a breakup. Or a loss of something. Someone's going through a loss. It can be anything. Money, job, relationship. You know. And also. Someone is like. Out of control. So. This is somebody that can't control their anger. Okay. They can't control their anger. And this is somebody that needs. Uh. Uh anger management class or something this is someone got a hot temper a, a very hot temper that's like the easy to snap cocoa pop cracker jack on somebody's back or on theirs you know spirit yeah well, this could be someone i don't know could be very dangerous and very abusive okay spirit what are the messages for all zodiac signs what is going on with every one of these spirit what are the messages for all zodiac signs? For all zodiac signs. What do we need to know here? See, spirit. What are the messages for all? Hey, somebody is um is trying to. I don't know. Someone could be very abusive, controlling, bullying you. It could be several people. Um, this could be. I don't know. Somebody ganging up on you, spirit. What are the messages? Give me more. What are the messages for all zodiac signs, spirit guides? My God, angel, angel ancestors, the masters, my God, angel, holy spirit. What is going on right now with everyone, spirit? What are the energies right now? What is happening? Okay, let me cut these cards. Or should I cut them? Let me see. Yeah, the bottom card we have five of cups. So this could be a water sign, or this could be any sign. But someone's grieving, hurt, crying, stressed out. Oh, feeling regretful, hurtful or something. Yeah, be careful. Someone's moving in silence, up to no good, sneaky, up to something, want to steal, take something from you. Be careful with carjacking, robbery, and shit like that. Okay. So, guys. I'm going to cut the cards, Okay. Yeah, what are the messages for all zodiac signs? Yeah. Yeah, someone could be feeling stuck and trapped. The eight of swords can be a Gemini or it could be any sign. But someone's feeling trapped, stuck in their heads. It could be spiritual jail or they could be in jail or they can just be stuck and trapped in their thoughts. 
could be thinking a lot, depressed, stressed out, worrying about something, or someone could be trying to make you feel this way. Like somebody, I don't know, maybe someone's projecting on you, uh, sending bad energy towards you, wants you to feel like you can move, you can move on, confused, trapped, insecure. You know, like somebody wants you to doubt yourself, give up, don't move. The bottom card, we have the Empress. So this could be a Libra or this could be any sign, okay? Someone's chilling, relaxing at home, okay? Someone is just on their throne, moving it on. This could be someone, this could be a parent. You could be pregnant or you could just have kids already, okay? But this is someone's very mature, intelligent, smart, very wise, knowledgeable, uh, very intuitive, very, could be a chosen one, a leader, like someone's like a mother figure, a, a wife material, a husband, whatever you want to call it. But this is someone that's very loving, caring, nurturing, understanding. She loves unconditionally. It's like she's like, she loves to give people advice. She loves to help people. Um, she could be a counselor, a therapist, or a therapy, or a psychiatrist, or she could just be someone that have a, a heart. This is someone that been there and done that. This is someone that been through some shit and they done came out of it. It's like they, whatever that they've been through made them stronger. You know what I'm saying? So they could have been betrayed, deceived, hurt, whatever. This, this empress, okay? It could be any sign. But this is somebody is like a leader and they're here to help people teach guidance, you know. Okay. You could be having a Pisces come towards you, a water sign. Someone's coming towards you. They want to give you something, a gift. They want to apologize. They want your forgiveness. Or this could be a secret admirer, okay? So this could be an ex as well. Somebody's coming back. Maybe somebody didn't know your worth, see your worth at the time, or they didn't believe in you. They always accuse you, blame you, whatever, because they insecurity, they low self-esteem, and now they come in. Or this could be someone, like I said, that, that's that been waiting to tell you how much they like you, how much they've been like crushing on you, you know? Okay, so let's see what is going on. Oh, with these cards, spirit. Hmm. Let's see. Spirit, what are the messages? Give me more. Hmm. What do we need to hear for all zodiac signs? What are the messages right now, spirit? What is going on? What do we need to know, spirit? What do we need to know, spirit? What are the messages? What do we need to know, Spirit? We got two of cups. Okay. And we have the ace of wands. So, so this could be a counselor, water sign, or it could be any sign. But somebody wants to ask you out on a date, take you out on a date, show you around town. You know what I mean? Um, this could be an ex of yours, or this could be someone new. But someone feels like you two have some type of connection, some type of bond or chemistry. You never know. Keep your cards up. It can be tricky. You never know. This could be someone that just want to give you some sex. Maybe somebody want to give you the donkey donuts. Okay? Or someone could be cloud chasing you because they see that you're being seen. Like, it's like you popular or something or this could be someone cloud chasing you this could be someone that noticed you you could be in the public eye, social media or whatsoever but be very careful make sure okay you know people come back for a reason people like a person for a reason but make sure this person you know is in a relationship with you for the right reason why do they want to take you out why do they want to date you we're going to clarify this okay so just make sure you're not being taken advantage of or speak. Give me more than two of cups. What's the two of cups spirit? I'm picking up a fire sign. This could be someone from your past coming back. Maybe this person feel like you're um, moving on with someone or they have a feeling that you're moving on or they coming in to make things right with you, to make things work with you. 
Okay, so we have the hangman. So like I told you, whoever this person is, keep your guards up. Is this somebody who wants to hold you back? Or this could have been someone that had you on hold already and want to come back in your life. Or this is somebody that's coming in your life to, to cause blockages and to slow you down, to slow down your process, to slow down your progress. This could be someone that just want to just, I don't know, cause delays and blockages for you, stop you from doing something. Yeah, the hey man. Or this could be someone that's that's an ex of yours or whoever the ex that's coming back that could have had you waiting, had you on hold. Yeah, this could have been someone that you dated already. Also, they want another chance with you. Because they could have had you on hold because they was in a relationship with someone else probably. Or this is somebody's coming in your life to, I don't know, to cause delays in your life, blockages, to slow you down or some shit. Spirit, give me more on the hangman. Whoever this hangman, this person, who? Spirit, what's the hangman? Give me more on the hangman. What's the hangman? Yeah, this is somebody seeing your blow up, your show up, your glow up, the sun. And this is somebody don't want to see you happy. They don't want to see you shine like a diamond. This could be someone that's trying to come in between your success, your happiness, your peace, your joy. Okay, it could be that. Like somebody, yeah, you being shining in a bright light, in a spotlight. So there's some clout chasing shit. Like somebody knows that you're you're very popular or, or famous or successful or whatever you got going on, whatever you're doing. You're very talented and you're gifted. And this is somebody uh, discover you, they notice you, or they or somebody that you know already. And this is somebody you see that you're shining, you're moving on, you're moving forward, your career's taking off. You're happy without them. Okay, spirit. Be very careful. Somebody might try to get you pregnant. Spirit, what's the hangman? Give me more on the hangman. Thank you. Okay. I, what did I say? We have the page of cups, right? Is it page of cups or knight of cups? Let me see. Knight of cups. So water sign. So this is, like I said, this is somebody who wants another chance with you. This could be a secret mile. This is somebody who wants to show forgiveness. They want to apologize to you. Like I said, this could have been somebody that had you on hold waiting. And all of a sudden, they want to come back in your life. So, or this could be a secret mile. I did say that already, okay, spirit. But just be very careful. Ask yourself, why is this person bad? Why do this person want to talk to me? Why this person here? Why? What do this person want? Like, you know. Just keep your guards up. Watch the red flag. Spirit, give me more on the page. I mean, the Knight of Cups. The Knight of Cups. For the collector reading. What's the Knight of Cups? Spirit. Knight of Cups for the collector reading. What's the Knight of Cups? Spirit. What's the Knight of Cups? Knight of Cups. Judgment, like I said, this could have been someone that passed judgment on you, lied on you, betrayed you, deceived you. This is judgment on this person. This person is being found out, caught up like ketchup. That's the reason why they're coming towards you, probably because karma probably getting to them. Yeah, judgment. So, spirit wants this person to apologize to you, or spirit letting you know that this this is somebody is something that they did. They could be running from it, or like I said, they feel guilty, they feel wrong for accusing you, lying on you, betraying you. Yeah, this is judgment. Like, this is somebody <laughs> didn't see your worth. They didn't want to see your worth, maybe because they were too stubborn, or they were too busy whoring around, cheating, and lying on you, and they blaming you for doing all this shit. Yeah, judgment. Yeah, this person could have lied to the court people, the the legal situ uh, court case this person could have told lies on you backstabbed you betray you in some type of legal situation court justice system so this person is being found out caught up this person yeah judgment judgment's coming down on this person that's why they come in towards you to apologize to you because they know karma is a bitch yeah, so whatever they did to you, 
uh, they being judged. They they finna get judged. They finna either go to jail, get sentenced, or uh, karma. Something that they did or said. Spirit, give me more. Or oh, this could be your spirit guys warning you about this person. Your loved ones from heaven it could be shouting, trying to get a message across towards you. This could be your loved ones trying to tell you, hey, watch this person. Keep your guards up with this person. Okay, spirit. Give me more on the judgment. What's the judgment about? What's the judgment? Clarify, what's the judgment, spirit? <laughs> This person could have been very abusive. We have the seven of wands. So this can be a group of people. Maybe this person turned some people against you. Uh, this could be several people trying to come at you, gang stalk you, jump you, uh, bully you. Like I said, this could be your ancestors trying to tell you to watch out. All right, some people or this fire sign. Somebody thinks they control you. Someone thinks they own you, uh, trying to fear you, scare you. Um, spirits, say keep your guards up. Defend yourself. Stand up for yourself. You know, protect yourself. But like I said, this could be some people. I don't know. Somebody that says some shit about you and got people coming at you like 40 going north. Okay, like I said, this could be this fire sign that's trying to control you, abuse you, mistreat you, stop you from moving on, moving forward. Or you could have blocked this person or you need to block these people or this person. But like I said, these people are trying to gang up on you and shit. So your spirit guys want you to, they're trying to tell you, listen, pay attention to your intuition and psychic abilities or something. Now uh, somebody is Mm, just be very careful. Spirit, give me more on the Knight of Cups for the collector reading. So be very, very careful where you're going, who you out with, who you're going to see, who you hanging out with. You never know. Motherfucker's crazy. Spirit, what's the Knight of Cups? What's the Knight of Cups, Gia? You just never know a person. A motherfucker be pretending. Like they cool with you, but at the same time, they're the enemy, a friend of me. Nine of Pentacles. Yeah, somebody see that you're the Nine of Pentacles. You're happy. You're, you're content. You're unbothered. You're very independent. You're feeling good. You're looking good. You're smelling good. You're very confident. All right? Somebody sees that. And they want a taste of that. So like I said, it's going to be an ex or someone new. Like somebody see you doing well by yourself. You know? Yeah. Like I said, this is somebody didn't see your word, didn't know your word, don't want didn't want to see your word. Somebody see that, that you you're responsible. You don't need them for shit. You know, you don't need them for shit. This could be someone that's very attracted to you. They could be high. They could be smoking weed on drugs or high or something. They could be having, um, they could be fantasizing about you and stuff. Um, yeah, this could be someone addicted to your sex, addicted to you, or this could be someone that's very promiscuous. This water sign. This person could be very promiscuous. This person could be like, I don't know. Maybe they want to ask you out to drink and smoke, pop smoke or something. Like somebody want to get you high and drunk. Uh, you know what I mean? Somebody like very attracted to you. They have sexual desires for you. Spirit, this could be an ex of yours or somebody new. But somebody, um, yeah, spirit, what's the hey man? Hmm. Someone could be coming towards you. And someone could be coming towards you. Okay? Be careful, spirit. Yeah. Make sure you watch driving. If you're driving or crossing the streets or anything, just be very careful. Yeah, this could be someone rushing in towards you. 
Hmm, spirit, what's the hangman? I mean, what's the chariot? What's the chariot? Just um, five of wands, fights and arguments, guys. So be very, very careful, okay? I'm seeing the police being called, the ambulance and shit. Fights and arguments. If somebody's coming in to, to start some shit with you. So, yeah, guys, be very careful. It's been a car accident. Like, you know how you get into a car accident with something? I have seen that. And people next to you know they get out their car, they start arguing with each other, they start fighting. Man, why you hit my car? Bitch, why you hit my car? <laughs> Spirit, give me more on the hangman. What's the hangman? Yeah, this could be somebody that's come in that's not who they said they are. Spirit, what's the hangman? Hmm. What's the hangman, Spirit? The nine of cups. This could be someone that's drunk and high, that have a gender, that wants to have sex with you, get you drunk and high, uh, and shit like that. Spirit, give me more on the hangman. Yeah, this could be someone that, that have some type of sex addiction or drug addiction. Or, I don't know. It could be messing around with a lot of people. That's why they had you on hold waiting. This could be someone that's very promiscuous. Spirit, give me more on the uh, hey man. Clef out of hey man, Spirit. Yeah, this could be someone that um, maybe they had you on hold because they gained a lot of weight. Or something like that. Or, oh, um, I don't know. Some shit like that. Maybe they was having some type of weight problem. Or, I don't know. Something that they hiding, you know. Spirit, give me more on the hangman, please. Thank you. Hmm. What's the hangman? Yeah, this could be a friend of me. Enemy. King of Wands. The Queen of Wands came out. Yeah, this could be someone that's like, I don't know, they give me that evil look. This could be a player. This could be a friend of me, an enemy. This could be someone that's wearing a mask, a fake friend, a fake lover, a family member. Yeah, the Eight of Swords, they give you that look. This person can be a witch or a warlock, this Queen of Wands. This person could be a witch or a warlock. She could be doing binding spells on you projecting on you shit like that spirit give me more it's weird it's a fake friend this is somebody that's uh jealous uh, envy of you spirit what's the two of cups Ooh, we are reading spirit what's the <laughs> what's the two of cups spirit the two of pentacles, like somebody just wants to juggle you, have sex with you. Okay, this could be someone juggling two people. This could be someone that had you in a third party that wants to put you in a third party. This is somebody that just want to use you for sex or money, uh, breadcrumb you, juggle you, have you off balance like them. So what's the uh, two of cups? Two of cups. Yeah, two of cups. The knight of swords. Yeah, guys. Remember I said somebody was coming in because they have a feeling that you might be moving on or dating somebody new. This is a fire sign that's rushing in real quick. This could be your ex. Or somebody's coming in real quick. Somebody... I don't know, someone could be getting caught cheating, lying, or someone's coming in real fast to to fix the relationship with you because this person knows that you're moving on. Someone knows that you're moving on, you're moving forward. Like somebody don't want you to date no one else. They don't want you to be with no one else, so they're coming in. This person might not even want you. They just don't want you to be with no one, see you with anyone. They just don't want to see you happy or make someone else happy. So this could be an ex or somebody all of a sudden just flying in. All of a sudden they want to tell you they love you. Or this could be a friend of me, an enemy. This could be somebody that 
thinks you with they man or with they woman. They want to fight you and all that bullshit. This could be someone that's very abusive or someone jealous of your relationship. Someone could be mad because you moved on. You found the new love or you with someone else. Or this is somebody just, mm, just don't like who you dating, who you with. Spirit, what's the seven of wands? So just be very careful. Spirit, what's the seven of wands for the collector reading? Hmm. What's the seven of wands, spirit? So you just never know. Queen of swords. I mean, king of swords. So you could be de defending yourself. I'm sorry. You could be standing up for yourself. You could be telling this fire sound. These people don't fuck with you. You're the wrong person to be fucking with. So you could be defending yourself, standing up for yourself, protecting yourself, speaking back. Yeah. Maybe these people thought you was a punk bitch, a coward, a loser. I don't know. Somebody thought you was scared of them. I guess they thought because you mind your business, you're quiet, you're intelligent, and they must think they can't uh, push your butt and you let out like a let out couch on their ass. So this could be some people that's trying to try you or this fire sign. And you like, bitch, period. You know? <laughs> Yeah, it's like you cold. Like you let a motherfucker know you don't have to like me, but you're going to respect me. I don't give a fuck who it is. Okay? Yeah. Five of ones, fights and arguments, competition, jealousy. I want to be careful about going out to clubs tonight. Like somebody trying to set you up, get you jumped on. Motherfuckers going to be getting drunk and high. Get the fighting and shit. Busting bottles on top of each other's head. <laughs> so, yeah, this could be a group of people, frenemies and enemies, or somebody could be trying to set you up or, like, turn against you or some shit. Spirit, give me more on this Knight of Swords for the collector reading. So, what's the Knight of Swords? Who is this Knight of Swords, Spirit? Clef had a knight of swords. Knight of swords. What does knight of swords want? Oh, Lord. This person is a player. A knight of wands. And we got the eight of swords. Yeah, this is somebody is coming in. This is a player, a mac daddy, a sugar mama or something. This is somebody that's jealous, okay? They can trick off uh, or whatever you want to call it. But they don't want to see you see someone else. They don't want to see you go out on a date. So this is somebody who's a, a hater. A cop blocker. Yeah, this is somebody who's coming in. They don't want you to be happy with someone else. They don't want you to be in love with someone else. Because they know it's going to be like stars and fireworks in the sky. You know, whatever, whoever you meet, it's going to be love and, and all that good stuff. So this is somebody, this is a player. This is somebody that's coming in. They've been cheating and shit, tricking off, lying, betraying you, deceiving you. And they just want to come back and block you, block your happiness. Eight of swords, they just want to come back in, keep you stuck in trap. They can be stuck in trap on you. Maybe they can't move on, move forward from you. Okay, so this is somebody coming in, let you know, hey, they want to explain something to you and get willing to tell you how much they miss you, why they left you, why they ghosted you, why they neglected you, why they abandoned you, why they cheated on you, why they did what to you. And it's going to be lies. Eight of swords, they just want to come in and they just want you to be stuck and trapped alone by yourself, depressed and stressed out. Or like I said, this is how they are feeling. Okay. Spirit, give me more on the uh, Queen of Wands. Queen of Wands. This is somebody who wants to confuse you or they confuse their damn self. Spirit, what's the Queen of Wands? This is somebody who wants to see you le like left out in the cold, struggling, juggling, going through a loss, lonely and sad and miserable, going through poverty, this could be a fire sign that want to mistreat you, abuse you. This person could have mistreated you, did some shit to you. 
left you or neglected a child by you as something. This is somebody that's abusive. They could have abused you, mistreat you, hurted you in some kind of way. Okay? They could have left you like the five of pentacles. This is somebody watching you struggle or they want you to struggle. Or this is somebody wanting you to go through poverty. They want to see you in pain, miserable. Hmm. Yeah. It's a fire sign. It can be any sign, okay? Yeah, this is somebody that's that's selfish, evil. They could, like I said, they could have neglected you, abandoned you, mistreated you, or they could have done their child like that. You could have a child by this person. And they could have done this to your child, to you, left you guys out in the cold, abandoned you guys. Or this is, like I said, this is somebody wants to see you struggle, juggle, homeless, unhappy. Spirit, give me more on the Nine of Pentacles. Nine of Pentacles, Spirit. Give me more than Nine of Pentacles. Yeah, this is somebody is like giving you that evil look, looking at you. This could be someone that doing spell work. And this person could be a witch or a warlock. This could be someone that got a cat too. This could be someone that's doing spell work on you and shit. Want you to feel like you're unloved. Want you to feel hopeless, worthless, useless, shitless. Spirit, what's the Nine of Pentacles? This is somebody that's a narcissist. Fucking devil. So what's the nine of pentacles? Victory and success. Six of wands. This is you. You know, moving on, moving forward. Your career is taking off. This is you winning and spinning, not bending. All right? Victory is yours. You could be a leader. Whatever you do in the public, ad, social media. You have a lot of followers. You have a few followers. People like you. Some don't like you. You know, you got somebody that's looking around the corner and peeping and watching you on your channel, trying to see are you what, what's your next move, what you're doing, what you got going on. So this is you. Whatever you got going on or whatever you're doing. Okay? You got some people that's hey, they want to, they hoping that you end your success. They, um, they, like they wish you ill and bad on you. Like somebody wants to end your career, your success. Somebody wants to put an end to whatever you got going on, whatever you're doing. Like somebody's just threatened by that. And they want to put an end to it. They want to stop you. They want to betray you, deceive you in some kind of way. Or they could have done it already. But yeah, this is somebody. Yeah. Why is my car like this? This is somebody's watching you online, YouTube, uh, Facebook, TikTok, Instagram, or whatever. This is somebody's watching you. Spirit, give me more on a King of Swords for the collector reading, Spirit. What's the King of Swords? What's the King of Swords, Spirit? The devil. This is somebody that's jealous of you, envy of you, toxic, low vibration, dysfunctional, negative, uh, like a narcissist. Okay. This could be a group of people. Somebody. This is somebody that you attach you to or you need to break the chain or cut the ropes from. This could be someone that's jealous of you, very toxic. Uh, this is someone that's, that could be like a I don't know. This is somebody that's doing some deceptive things to you behind your back. They could be projecting on you. Well, I can't talk. What the fuck is that? They could be, yeah, projecting on you. Um, sending you negative energy. The evil eye. Could be doing spell work on you and shit. Thinking evil things. Wishing ill on you and shit. Toxic, narcissistic. This could be your family, a so-called family, people around you. Or this could be somebody working against you or these people. Like jealousy. Somebody's jealous of you. This could be a family member, a friend, friend of me, enemy, but somebody, yeah. Yeah, like very toxic. Yeah, this is somebody you need to break that chain, cut that rope from, because they toxic, they low vibration, and they they the devil, they very dark and demonic, 
evil spirit. Give me more on the Eight of Swords. So this is somebody, I don't know, they, yeah, they trying to stop you. Mm. Yeah, this could be some people, like I said, Spirit, what's the Eight of Swords? Give me more on the Eight of Swords. Oh, these cars are tripping. What's the Eight of Oh, wait a minute, cars? What's going on with the energy now? The Eight of Swords, Spirit. What's the Eight of Swords for the collective? The moon car wanted to come out. Someone could have been, yeah, pay attention to your dreams, your psychic abilities, your intuition, your third eye. Okay? It's trying to tell you something about these people or this water sign. Or this fire sign. Something is being hidden from you. Lies, betrayal, gossiping. Spirit, what's the Eight of Swords? Eight of Swords. Yeah, someone could be doing moon magic on you. The star card. Star card speaks about Aquarius. I don't know if this is Aquarius making you feel this way, making you feel some kind of way, or someone knows you a star, star quality, star qualifications. This is somebody that that don't want you to uh, succeed, achieve something. This is somebody could be just because you're a star. Somebody don't want you to heal. Yeah, the Eight of Swords. Somebody don't want you to heal. Gemini or Aquarius or it could be any sign. Somebody don't want you to heal. Someone knows that you have changed. You could be a healer, a practitioner, a light worker, a dancer, a singer. Something that you do, you're very successful. You're very gifted. You're very talented in. And this is somebody don't want to see you accomplish something. Like somebody don't want you to heal. They don't want you to change. You could be a star sea, an earth angel, a chosen one. Yeah, somebody's trying to stop you from doing something. Something that you're very destined. You, like I said, uh, you could be a um, ascending alignment. Like somebody's trying to stop you. Something that you're doing. You could be very spiritual, a healer. Like somebody don't like your gifts, your talents. Like somebody don't like you being like taking care of yourself you know somebody don't want you to prosper like somebody don't want you to heal or change okay like somebody's jealous because you're a star you know you have star qualities you're a star you can be very popular famous beautiful gorgeous whatever you do in the public eye somebody's jealous of that so give me more on the five of pentacles i'm about to get off five of pentacles spirit so whatever you're doing, somebody don't want you to do it. They want you to be stuck and trapped like them. No vibration and toxic and negative. Yeah. Hmm. Or this could be Aquarius that's doing this to you. Or like I said, this could be any sign. Like somebody could be. Spirit, what's the Five of Pentacles? Five of Pentacles, Eight of Pentacles. Like someone could be jealous of your work, your money, how well you doing, your your career, whatever you working on, whatever you're doing. Like somebody's jealous of that. Whatever you doing, somebody is jealous. Like somebody see how well you do in something. Okay, it's like somebody can be jealous because you're making money, you get money, you your career, something that you're very gifted in, something that you're working on, something that you're doing. Like, Spirit, what's the Five of Pentacles? Yeah, someone could be jealous of you. Like, someone could be trying to put your work down. Like, someone could be trying to put down, like, put you down, like, spirit. What's the Five of Pentacles? 
What's the Five of Pentacles? This could have been an Aries, a father figure. A divine wannabe masculine. This could be someone that's very childish, abusive. Yeah, they could be watching you, very deceptive towards you. This could be a water sign spreading lies and rumors and shit about you. Something's about to hit the fan. Something's about to blow up like a volcano. Like something's going to be exposed about somebody or someone. Spirit, give me more on the Five of Pentacles. What's the Five of Pentacles, Spirit? Five of Pentacles. Yeah, the moon car. Some deception going on. Like someone's doing some deception shit behind your back. Somebody's hiding something, doing some shit, gossiping, lying, spreading lies in rooms. Could be a water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Pay attention to your dreams, your psychic abilities. Like I said, your third eye. About somebody or something. Yeah, this could be somebody just talking shit, saying shit out their mouth, trying to make you look bad, feel bad, make you look stupid, like them. Spirit, give me more on the six of wands. This is somebody trying to make you feel shameful, embarrassed, like them. <laughs> yeah, this is somebody talking shit. Could be a family member, friend, a group of people, a group of um, I don't know what. So what's the six of wands? Six of wands. Oh shit! Excuse me. This could be a fire sign. This fire sign is crazy. <laughs> Let me tell you something. Your spirit guides are keeping this person back from you. This person could be very dangerous, out of control, have anger problems. This is somebody is mad. They pissed off because they see that you are successful. You're winning. If somebody see that you just moving on. Someone thought you was going to be miserable without them. But this person is like your spirit guys is tainting this person. They keeping this person from you. Whoever you are, it might be me, it might be you, or who, but your spirit guys are tainting this fire sign. This person is like mad as hell. This this person is is mad as hell at you. Like somebody is jealous, pissed the freak off because you're winning. Like this, yeah, this fire sign. Yeah, it's your angels, your ancestors, your spirit guides is keeping this person away from you. Maybe they, they ancestors, they spirit guides could be keeping it, keeping them away from you as well because they know how this person is. But your ancestors and spirit guides don't play. They is tainting this motherfucking person. They, excuse me, they is maintaining this person. This person is like, they want to, this person can be very dangerous. This fire sign. Spirit. Now, this person is very jealous. So give me more on the uh, strength card. What's the strength card? This person can be very immature. This person wants to ask you out. They want to give you something, but they're immature about it. Okay? They're very mad and they're disappointed because you rejected them. You turned them down. Or this could be a water sign you turned down. Someone's disappointed or they wanted you to be disappointed and upset going through a loss. Okay, anyway, let me hurry up. Spirit, give me more on the moon card. What's the moon? What's the moon? What's hitting? What's the secrets? What's the moon? The moon card, Spirit. Clarify the moon card. Something about, hmm. Let's see. Knight of Pentacles. So, Earth sign Virgo could be coming towards you. What this person is on. What this person is up to. The moon, this could be someone's tricking off with a water sign. So, it could be 
having one night stands, threesomes, like someone could be paying for sex, sneaking off. Or this is somebody who wants to have a threesome with you. Or I don't know, the, the Knight of Pentacles. What's the moon, the Knight of Pentacles? Like someone's traveling towards you so, or someone's sneaking off or tricking off with somebody. Like someone's going to pay you, pay somebody or buy something. Business and pleasure or something. Somebody's going to buy something or do something. <laughs> What's the Knight of Pentacles? Come on. What's the Knight of Pentacles? You could be pretending like you're not home. You could be guarding yourself, protecting yourself from this person or you need to. Yeah. Spirit. Well, listen to your intuition. Yeah. About this Knight of Pentacles, this Earth sign. Yeah, the High Priestess. This person could be hiding something. What's the High Priestess? Listen to your intuition. This person could be dealing with a Scorpio, a water sign. I don't know, it's weird. Spirit, what's the Knight of Pentacles? Yeah, the Two of Swords. Yeah, you protecting yourself, guarding yourself. You pretending like you're not home. Okay, what's the Knight of Pentacles, Spirit? Knight of Pentacles. Yeah, the Eight of Wands. This is... Huh. This could be someone love bombing you. Or someone you haven't seen in years, or it's been a long time since you and this person got together, or hmm, like something's been a long time. Hmm. Spirit, give me more on the. Uh, I'm sorry, eight of wands. The eight of wands. What's the eight of wands? What's the eight of wands? Hmm. The seven of swords. Oh, guys, be very careful who y'all hook up with, who y'all get involved with. I mean, I'm gonna end this reading because it's it's like uh so be very careful who you hook up with, get involved with. So what's the um what's the seven of swords? What's the seven of swords? What's the seven of swords? Justice. Mm -hmm. Be very careful. So I'm just trying to, I don't know, rob you, take something, steal something. Just be very careful, Spirit. Give me more on the uh, star card. What's the star card, Spirit? What's the star card? Yes, the Scorpio came out, King of Cups. Someone could be looking at you because you're a star. You could be an earth angel. Like someone's sight out of you. This could be a Scorpio that's sight out of you. Now someone's looking at you like, ugh, like... This could be a jealous friend, friend of an enemy, a family member. Yeah, you could be an earth angel, practitioner, light worker, a healer, a sin. Yeah, you could be a star seed or earth angel. Oh, oh, that's so sweet. You're protected or put up your protection. Okay. Either you're, 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 you could be protected, but spirit wants you to put up your protection as well. Pray more. All right, pray more, sage, or whatever you need to do. Yeah, spirit. What's the devil? What's the devil? How about a devil? A fucking fire sign. It's a fire sign. Like I said, this could be someone that's toxic. Uh, I don't know. Or this is somebody who knows these people against you or don't like you. All right. Anyway, this is your collective reading, guys, for today, honey, tonight, or so ever. All right, guys, stay prayed up and keep your guards all the way up. Smooches.